September 11, 2001. A day in our history we will always remember for the thousands of lives that were lost and the thousands of heroes that emerged. We are surrounded by individuals who for no other reason emerge as heroes, doing so much for so many, unselfishly and with true sincerity and love. What better day to recognize these individuals, the ones we call our local heroes. I was born in Boston, Massachusetts. I had a twin brother. I was born a half an hour later than him. So he was older than me and took care of me along the way. In 1945, the Santa Maria Mission, located on the block west of 22nd and Wall Avenue, was opened. In 1955, the mission was fortunate to be the assistant of a young Jesuit named Father Neil Herlick. He was to be the new priest, as well as a teacher at the new St. Joseph's High School. At that same time, the mission began to experience tremendous growth and after raising $12,000, Bishop Hunt approved construction of a new church which was to serve all Catholics of West Ogden and Weber, Roy, Hooper, and Riverdale. In 1956, construction began on St. Mary's Church, currently located on Pennsylvania Avenue in Ogden. In 1957, the new St. Mary's was dedicated and Father Herlick joined Father Kern as assistant pastor. In 1974, Father Herlick succeeded Father Kern as pastor of St. Mary's and continued as an educator at St. Joseph's High School until retiring in 1987 after 32 years of teaching. In January 1993, Father Herlick retired as pastor of St. Mary's. In August 2002, he celebrated his Golden Jubilee, 50 years as a Jesuit priest. And then we grew up in Boston and Newport, Rhode Island for a few years until about the age of eight or nine. And then we came west because my father was a uh, officer in the Navy and he was on shore duty for a year and a half and sea duty for about three years. And we lived in California most of our lives, San Diego, San Pedro, Seattle, Washington, San Francisco, along the... And most of my life was swimming in the Pacific Ocean, and I enjoyed that very much. Catholic school in St. John's High School in San Diego, California, for about five years with the Sisters of St. Joseph of Carondelet, then later went to a high school at St. Anthony's in Long Beach and also a public school for a while and then a public high school, San Pedro, California. And then we were transferred in 1934 to Shanghai, China and the Philippines. And I went to the Catholic high school in Shanghai, the Jesuit Fathers. And at 14, I decided to become a Jesuit priest and later came back to the United States. When you walk
Father Herlich, uh, we just wanted to say that you have wit, charm, wisdom, and most important, love, an enduring quality, and when you give of yourself, you give to others. Love is the most important of all. We're here tonight to honor you, a person who has really shown in his outstanding field of interest. You, Father, have made various commitments and always stood by them. As Will Rogers said, we can't all be heroes. Someone has to sit on the sidelines and clap for you. But Father, we'll be clapping for you because you are our hero. Many remember Father Herlich for his participation in the lives of so many in the parish and the community by participating in sporting events, running Boy Scout troops, founding the St. Joseph's High School Booster Club, and overseeing the Religious Education Center. Even today, at the young age of 84, he continues to enjoy his retirement here in Ogden, amazingly attending every high school ball game, his daily fishing trips, and weekly bridge game. Father Herlich is deeply beloved by generations of parishioners, students, and alumni. I entered the society from Seattle, California at the age of 19 after a year at Long Beach Junior College and a year at the University of Washington. Entered in Long Beach in uh, Los Gatos, California at the Sacred Heart Jesuit Center and then ended up there in 1998 after I left here for a few years and then came back for a second spring, a second tour of duty because I wanted to have some communication with St. Joseph's High School, St. Joseph's Elementary School, the teachers, the friends that I had had here before I left. And that's been my happiness and given me more energy and helped me psychologically. Aside from his many accomplishments, Father Herlich has made a tremendous impact in this community for almost 50 years and has touched the lives of so many. Please join us in honoring our hero with a Lifetime Achievement Award. <laughs>